Hi there team, today we are going to look at the results of the two experiments that I set up yesterday. If you remember, my little potato osmometers. Alright, so in this, in this one, there was water on the outside and water on the inside. And the water has not risen past the level where I put that two step in because there's no net movement of water. Same amount of water is moving in and out of the potato. Okay, by osmosis. The second one, right, in this one, there was a syrup solution in the middle and it has risen about that much about, above the level of the two step, indicating that more water moves into the potato by osmosis and only a little bit out because the sugar, um, the syrup solution in the middle has got a lower water concentration and the water on the outside of the potato has got a higher water concentration. And remember, osmosis only occurs if the water molecule pass through a membrane. And the, the membranes here are the membranes of the potato cell. Right. The um, next experiment was this one. So here, the um, carrot discs were placed in water. So I'm going to take it out. Just dry them off a little bit. Okay. All right now. They are really, really hard. Okay, think of a carrot when you make salad or something. They are much, much harder. All right, I'm going to weigh them. The mass is 6.68 grams. I'll show you the results now. Okay, and the ones that we placed in full solution. Then I'll watch you. They are very bendable. They pop. All right. Okay, and if I wear them, get it back to zero. And if I weigh them, they are five point nine five grams. All right, so they are my final results. So the, the discs that were placed in water, okay, they were 6.08 grams yesterday, and today they are 6.68 grams, indicating that the mass has gone up. So more water has moved into the disc from the water in the beaker, which has got a higher water concentration. There's a net movement of water into the disc because the cells inside the carrot. You know, they've got vacuoles and cytoplasm, so there's salt and sugar there, which lowers the water potential. All right, the ones that are placed in the salt water solution, the initial mass was 6.40 grams and it's gone down to 5.95 grams. Before, now there's a very concentrated salt solution on, on, in the beaker, and this, um, the concentration of salt is much higher than in the cells of the carrot disc. So therefore, more water moves out of the carrot disc, um, a net movement of water out of the carrot disc. The vacuoles in the cells will shrink, so therefore the cells are no longer turgid, and I am able to do the carrot disc. Okay, so that's a simple demonstration showing um, of in action.